This is the Church by Sarah Raymond Cunningham, illustrated by Ariel Landy. There's a little rhyme that children say, a song they sing sometimes when they play. This rhyme is about God's family. To do it, just move your hands like me. Here is the church. Here is the steeple. Open the doors and see all the people. What a great rhyme! Isn't it neat? But wait, this story's not yet complete. There's more to the church than just those two lines. To learn about God's family, let's add to this rhyme. Some churches are so big and wide, 10,000 people can fit inside. Other churches are really quite small. They fit just a few people and that is all. Some people have church right where they are, right in their houses. That's not very far. And not all churches have roofs or floors. Some don't have steeples, some don't have doors. Some people have churches under the stars and God comes in and meets them right where they are. And in places where it's not safe to be found, some people even have church underground. And church isn't something that stands still, you know. The church follows God's people wherever they go. The church moves in buses, planes, and cars to share God's love. The church has gone far. The church works among the sick, hungry, and poor, with people in need wherever they are. It's gone to cities, it's gone to towns, to school and to work, the church gets around. But how does this work? How can this be? Can a church really move like you and me? That's the secret, it certainly can. Church moves, moves through your feet, it works through your hands. The people are the church, don't you see? Church is a word for God's family. Because Jesus said, where there are two or three who gather in my name, that's where I'll be. So let's go back to the old rhyme now. Get your hands ready. We'll show you how. Here is a building. It may have a steeple. But where is the church? The church is the people. On this day, the church welcomes you. You're part of God's people. You're the church too. The end.